Hey guys, I'm Chris, and welcome back to the Magic School Bus, Explores the Age of the Dinosaurs. You always have to run into something with that many teeth? Now, Arnold, you love lots of toothy carnivores, like cats and dogs. Why pick on that Tarbosaurus just because it's not as cute as they are? Well, guys, we are in Mongolia. I want to say Cretaceous Mongolia, but I might be wrong about that. Anyways, let's explore since we didn't do that last time. Watch a mama protoceratops at work in Nest Watch. Use your mouth to help Gertie protect her eggs and babies from a hungry predator. Just click where you want Gertie to go and she'll headbutt those predators when she meets up with them. Level 1. <laughs> Not a good Down to six now. Definitely down to five now. Oh boy. Level six. Let's see if we can't get through this. Oh, I'm down to four. No, no. I think I'm down to three. Oh shoot, yeah, I'm down to three. Uh, 
that wasn't <laughs> that wasn't fair. We only lost one. Level eight. No, 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 no. I'm not losing. Wait, I'm not stuck in the animation. No! That's okay. You hold on to those eggs next time. Shoot! Oh well. Coming up, more Nest Watch! No, I'll pass, thanks. Level one. Nope. Okay. Thanks for playing! Doesn't oviraptor mean egg thief? Did that dinosaur steal those eggs it's sitting on? No, Arnold. Check this out. Paleontologists used to think oviraptors stole eggs and ate them. Then they found fossils that proved oviraptor was caring for its own eggs, not eating someone else's. Hmm. That I didn't know. Look at that poor dinosaur. She thinks she's a bird, but I don't think she'll ever make it off the ground. You said it, Phoebe. Scientists are still trying to figure out if Mononychus is a dinosaur or a bird. Or both. Liz, I like you better as a real live lizard than a fake dino fossil. Deserts are a good place to find fossils because dinosaur bodies were quickly covered up by sand. Just like Miss Frizzles here. <laughs> this desert is a pretty harsh place to live. There's hardly any rain. The dinosaurs must be rugged to deal with heat and only tough little plants to eat. Well then. They tell me you don't need me to the, the fossil record shows that Protoceratops lived in herds. Well, for the record, I'd hate to get in the way of that herd. Well then. Tons of dinosaur fossils have been discovered right here in the Gobi Desert in Mongolia. Dry weather and sand preserve the dinosaur skeletons until they fossilize. I feel myself fossilizing already. I don't know if there's room in the museums for a frizzlesaurus. Ouch. Let's go to the bus now that we've visited everywhere and go to the back bus dinotorium. Welcome back to the back bus dinotorium. Oh, well, let's view our back paleo to look cards. At your paleo cards. Have fun. Huh, apparently we only have three paleo cares. Oh well. See ya. Let's look at the games then, shall we? Round and round and round the games go. Where they stop, nobody knows. Like that. Mm -hmm. I think that's the next match. That's more fun. That's the whatever game. Hmm, I'm gonna Can you fill a dino's shoes? Play the footprint puzzle to find out. Ooh, footprint puzzle. Dinosaur tracks tell us a lot about the dinosaurs that made them. Use the pieces below to put this picture of tracks together and see what kind of dinosaur made them. Sauropods, okay. like a patasaurus, were huge herbivores with long necks and long tails. They walked on all fours and often moved in herds. Cool. Let's start with these edge pieces. I think for the most part, these 
these are in order. I might pass on that one for now, actually. Excuse me. Tell me you don't go there. Are you a corner piece? Oh, okay. Certain that does go there. Okay, fine, maybe it doesn't. Yeah, but well you go there, of course. Maybe, nope. <laughs> uh, I don't know. You think I'd be better at this whole puzzle thing? Sure to be not. No idea. Oh, there you go. You again. Oh, there we go. You go there. go somewhere. There we go. I think you go there. There we go. It's all coming together now. Still not sure on you. Yeah. You solved the puzzle! 
Hey, Tyrannosaurus, who are you burying your teeth at, you big tyrant you? Hey, little card, what's up? Keep putting the pieces together, and you'll procure a pile of paleo cards. Get ready for the next puzzle. This one won't be so easy. <laughs> Ceratopsians were big herbivores with horns, sort of like Cretaceous cows. They walked on all fours and frequently moved in herds. Really? So this isn't going too, too badly. Start with the edge pieces and go from there. So that's where the new things. Some of this is starting to make sense. Hold on, you should be over here. Hold on. There we go. There we go. It's all kind of sort of starting to make sense again. There we go. Welcome back to the Beck Bus Dinatorium. 
Gee, thanks. I already played that. I did that. We did the transformation one too. The nail one. Prepare to post some cards. Try your hand at past cards. Interesting. You can decorate your past card by dragging plants and animals from the boxes into the scene. Yeah, so I guess it's just a uh, generic. a bit of a generic thing here. This is going to be some card. Yeah, it is. There we go. You're eating that. You can eat that. Put that there. Hey, try putting something else in there. Uh, that is what I'm doing. Oh, that's it. So yeah, that's past cards. Basically a postcard maker. Come back next time you run out of past cards. Will do. Welcome back to the Back Bus Dinatorium. The bats. Hello, my name is... Yep, did that one. And that one. Oh, we've gone through all the games already. Well, guys, that basically does it. I see Ralphie standing by to tell you whose bones have been found in your neck of the woods. Ralphie? Spanning the globe to bring you the latest battle on bones. This is Wide World of Fossils. I'm your host, Ralphie. Today, we're going to learn what's been found where. So click on the map, and we'll get up close and personal with the creatures of the past. Thanks for the offer, Ralphie. And Alfie. so, we leave the world of fossils behind us, and return to the bus. Back to you, Frizz. Welcome back to the Back Bus Dinatorium. Well, that's actually going to do it for us, guys, because that's basically all the content we have. There's some educational stuff uh, here here, here, and here, but we're not really going to touch on that. Um, yeah. That being said, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, we'll have a new episode of something coming up on, uh, coming up on Saturdays to replace this series. I'm not quite sure what that is yet. I'm thinking that it might be another Magic School Bus game. If not, then we'll be going back to visit, to visit, to visit! Yay! We'll be going back to visit the one, the only, the Leisure Suit Larry. As I said, thanks for watching, and I'll see all you guys next time. Later.